Are you sure I can do this? Who doesn't love a good makeover, right? But makeovers are even better when they are done on our favorite celebrities within our favorite movies. Today, we are counting down the 10 best movie makeovers of all time, starting the countdown at number 10 with Emma Stone from Easy A. We love sweet, innocent virgin Emma as the star of Easy A, but when her character, Olive Pendergast, changes her look from girl next door to sexy and provocative to prove a point, she certainly has all the heads turning. But lucky for us, that look just didn't suit her and we got our sweet Emma back. An actress that was also in Easy A and is coming in at number 9 on our countdown is Amanda Bynes. We can't forget about her mega makeover in one of my personal favorite movies, She's the Man. Viola decides to double as her twin brother with an epic makeover so she can play soccer for the opposing team when the girls team is cut at her school. I am a dude. I am a hunky dude. I'm a badass hunky dude. But guys, let's be real, when Channing Tatum is on the opposing team, I think anyone would undergo that transformation for the chance to learn soccer from the hotness we know as Channing. At number eight, who could forget the movie that brought us a grungy FBI agent turned pageant beauty queen? That's right, I'm talking about Sandra Bullock in Miss Congeniality. <laughs> Though it may have taken hundreds of estheticians to wax, paint, and blow dry Gracie Lou Freebush in the movie, we all know it doesn't take that much work for Sandra Bullock in real life. It probably took Took more work to make her look gross in the movie because, guys, she's just that flawless. I'm in a dress. I have gel in my hair. I haven't slept all night. I'm starved and I'm armed. Don't mess with me. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. At number seven, we have Olivia Newton John in the movie Grease. Sandra D, just your good girl next door. But then, wow! Total chills that are multiplying, she was electrifying. In that all black tight off the shoulder leather pants get up and boy, you better shape up because this new look doesn't need a boy, she needs a man. Julia Roberts in Pretty Woman is another movie classic and another epic makeover coming in at number six. Though she looked hot as a streetwalker, I think most of us can agree we will take classic Julia Roberts with her strawberry long locks any day. Halfway point at number five is the beloved Robin Williams and Mrs. Doubtfire. Not only did Robin go through a makeover that gave us Mrs. Doubtfire, the process of the makeover in the movie was hilarious as he portrayed even the great Barbara Streisand before finally getting his mask, bodysuit, and English accent. Don't tell me not to live, just sit and putter. Life's candy and the sun's a ball of butter. Don't bring around a cloud to rain on my parade. Coming in at number four, Jennifer Lawrence as Katniss Everdeen. Cinna completed the ultimate makeover on Katniss, making her outfits blaze with fire at the Capitol, giving us the girl on fire. But that was nothing compared to his last work of art, the wedding dress President Snow wanted Katniss to wear, but of course Cinna added his own touch and with a famous Katniss twirl, turned the dress into a mockingjay. Brittany Murphy is on our countdown at number three when she got made over by Cher and Dion in the movie Clueless. She traded in her flannels for a plaid skirt and went from quote, tragically unhip to uh, a total Betty. Looks like Cher and Dion aren't totally clueless, at least when it comes to makeovers. Number two on our countdown is a girl that is so fetch. Katie Heron, played by Lindsay Lohan, went from new girl from Africa to cold, hard, shiny plastic with the help of Regina George and her minions. Even though Katie already thought she was really pretty before her makeover, she def was showing it all off to Erin Samuels with her new dress and big hair that night of her house party. And coming in at the number one spot on our countdown is the lovely Anne Hathaway in the movie Princess Diaries. Me? A, a princess? Shut up! From awkward schoolgirl Mia Thermopolis to Princess of Genovia, she definitely deserves to wear a crown with her new polished look. She was plucked, pricked, and groomed in more places than one, but certainly came out looking like the supergirl she is. It's exhausted. Because Majesty, only Paolo is going to take this and this and give you a princess. 
What was your favorite movie makeover? Can you think of a few favorites not mentioned? Sound off in the comment section below, and after that, click right over here to watch an epic Princess Diaries throwback. Thanks so much for hanging out with me here on Listed. I'm your host, Megan Lamontagne, and I'll catch you guys later.